Hey there everyone, new event, Call of Melody just dropped and in this video, we will be doing an overview of the gameplay and mechanics. As usual every details for the event is given on description but it's quite lengthy, so let's just get straight to how it goes once we're inside the instance. Basically this event is a 4 player mode where you compete with other players to see who can trigger Calling Melody the most, technically this means who deals the most damage among the group. However, do take note that stats and kits for each player are balanced in this mode so everyone is on equal footing in terms of damage output. So, how do we trigger Calling Melody? Listen well, because this is the core mechanic of this event. Just above our HP gauge, we will see icons of either a weapon type or weapon element. At first, they will be colored gray, but once you use a discharge from a corresponding weapon then they will lit up. Once the sequence have been perfectly executed, you will trigger Calling Melody, a mechanic which deal a massive amount of damage to enemies. Next, we'll talk about weapon switching. Simply put, once you switch out the weapon that you're currently using it will be automatically removed from your roster. You will, however, automatically get a replacement weapon for that one second after switching. At the bottom right corner of your screen, just above your three weapon slots, you will see what two kinds of weapons that you'll get once you let go of what you're currently holding. If you take a closer look, the weapon type and element are indicated for each weapon so you don't have to memorize them at all. Knowing the kits of each weapon are not needed as well, since what we're only after are their discharges. You can always just spam shit like I do, so no worries there. There are mechanics that would lead you to losing your progress for your calling melody as well. The countdown for the refresh is just below the icons for your buster call. As stated on number 5 using wrong discharge skills will also lead to a reset of your calling melody progress as you can see on this footage. Number 4 isn't really relevant but here's a tip on how to avoid number 5. Since we get an unlimited supply of weapons and the cooldown for swapping out is just a mere second, you can keep on discarding weapons that you don't need and just wait until you get the required ones for a melody. Basically, you need a little bit of patience and proper energy management. Another thing to watch out for is a random Fantasia from you or the other players because this can lead to a major mess up of your melody call. Now, let's talk about these buffs. The green orb restores HP and the red one grants you a discharge while the orange orb takes away your energy. Let's talk about the important ones. I'm sure you can already guess how to use the red one but how about the orange orb? See, this is another way to avoid mechanic number 5. Let's say you're one stack away from a calling melody and you don't have any of the required weapon yet but somehow already on a full discharge so you can't swap and roll for more weapons anymore. Immediately look for the orange orb so you can continue swapping out weapons without losing your melody call. The run will end once all waves have been cleared and the amount of currency that you can get will be based on your ranking first, but also by the number of calling melodies that you manage to trigger. On this particular run, I managed to place first and triggered a whopping 9 melody calls so I got 2550 currency points, which honestly left my mouth wide open. What do you guys think of this new event?